Hi all, very good morning. Today our topic is in our series the fourth one Apache Jmeter scripting challenge 4. Okay, this is the topic today you need to discuss about. Okay, without time waste you need to start the main the scenario. First of all scenario. <coughs> the scenario is I need to print the values in log and get the thread number in log values means which website URL is sent the request to the server you need to print the logs okay uh, the main scenario is I am already parameterized some bulk of URLs okay what which URL when you need to send the request to server right that's I, that time the user thread number Okay, the user thread number that is one and which URL you need to send to the server for request purpose. Both you need to print to the in JMeter log. In log console you need to print. That is our main intention. Okay, whenever the request is failed, right, you need to easily, you need to find out finding and you need to easily analyzing purpose. Okay. Okay, maybe now you understand right what is the exactly scenario you need to print to the uh, which URL you need to send to the server the request purpose which URL currently you send it to server that is you need to print to in log and same which user the URL you need to sending some user will be executed right the thread number you need to print it in, in logs in JMeter logs that is the main intention. Okay, now solution. First, you need to create the tree structure. First one test plan, thread group. You need to use the bean shell sampler. Okay, bean shell sampler, HTTP request, view results tree. This is the general you need to create the tree structure. After in under HTTP request, right? Example, this is the HTTP request, right? This under HTTP request in URL place you already parameterized. Okay, you already parameterized. Okay, you will give the dollar open and close the link will be given right the same format only you already parameterized that one. Okay, in moving to bean shell sampler right in variable you already declared what is the name will given to the in parameterized name same name link I will give it after where's dot put open same link you need to give in. Instead, on the same time, you can give the www.url.com. Actually, this is demo purpose only. I am creating just one user only need to execute right directly. I am giving the, this name uh, in original side. You can give same name, okay? Dollar open and close the brackets, give the link. Same name only you need to provide this place. Our demo purpose just one shot. You need to print this one and directly give the name after you can see another one where x equal to where's dot get link link means the same link means this is the www.google.com and this one will pass it to link right this link it's already declared now this link it's where it's available this place it's available okay this place what is the url it's available same url only available in our demo point of view but original script point of view whenever you already parameters the list right uh, it's a randomly or sequentially will be taken the data based on your CSV data set config file what you configure okay whenever you need to execute the step by step which URL you are sending that URL you need to came to this place and same only the link place also same URL you need to came and same one log.info value of x is plus x right this x value will be captured what is the URL you need to came that one will be printed this one log dot info right the log place you will print it to the, the x value will be printed the URL after where y equal to ctx means it's a citrix okay ctx dot get thread okay you can capture to the thread okay dot get thread name bracket same the thread number log dot info thread name is plus y right plus y means this one this thread number will be displayed okay 
this is the way you need to work guys the code also it's a very simple one okay it's not that much complex okay easily you need to understand and usually you need to implement also anything you need to print to the through logs okay this code also same only whatever j matrix available right same only i am right uh, just to copy paste okay now go to the j meter you can see it's very simple level i am creating okay whenever you need to implement right there are so many things available but say, the process is same you can create it your own self okay first one test plan just a minute it's not responding test plan and uh, moving to thread group after you can go to http request you can see http you can protocol http psi will give in dollar open and close link i will give the name you can give your own name okay not only this name okay this place what it's available right in bean shell sampler you can see www.google.com it's available okay whenever you need to give the same dollar open and close link you can give same one only it's passed okay nothing will be changed and this place you directly add to the in csv data set config file the path you can provide it but our demo purpose it's not required that that much range right that reason i am directly uh, this place you need to parameterize it. that is the first point you need to do and the second one i will give the directly name whenever you give to the the dollar open and close link in this place right that time what you need to do you need to add this csv data set config file and give the path the excel or notepad what you added the test data you need to provide it that time only it's work okay okay now our demo point it's not required i am already explained that this code also this is the variables where you need to capture that one it will stored and everything will come to the link place you already give the links and log only whatever you captured the uh, url it will paste it uh, it will be printed to the in your log and thread count will print it to the below okay now you need to see how we need to work okay i am already show right okay log means um, how you need to open log right you can see there is a icon right this one show the number of errors in log click open log viewer panel okay just to click on this one this is the log guys most of the everybody you know okay this is the log i'm already saved that one just click on run just a minute it loading yeah you can see now the http request just a second HTTP request is passed 200 and okay. Bean shell sampler also same 200 and okay. Both are its success, right? Now go to the log. Where it's printed that one? Yeah. You can see, guys. Uh, these two elements, you can see this one. Yeah. You can see bean shell, bean shell test element value of x. Okay, value of x is www.google.com. Okay, second one, bean shell test element, thread name is thread group one bar one. One bar one means first thread, first user. Okay, you can see now uh, the first one, one is URL is printed, and the same time, thread number also will be printed. Okay. This is the way you can capture to the whatever your scenario URL and thread number both it's captured right. This is the way you need to implement guys uh, the code level also whenever you need to not only this one this type of scenarios also you can easily you can implement your own self okay uh, something you need to modify your own self. Maybe that's all guys this video maybe you now you understand okay how we need to implement it's very simple not that much complicated first of all you need to understand the scenario our target just you need to print the log in logs 
uh, which URL you need to send the server, right? That is the first one and thread number. You can implement the uh, trace structure and you can already parameterize this, this one based on CSV that's a config file. Our site demo purpose I'm directly given. Whenever you're given, right, you need to add the CSV that's a config file in trace structure also and give the path. And bin shell processor, bin shell sampler, you can add this code, okay? And you need to execute it right automatically. This is single user directly will pick this the google.com one URL and thread number will be captured and directly will print it. Otherwise, you can add CSV data config file and parameterization file, everything you added right. You can execute it based on your URLs. Okay, that time, whenever based on user load, whatever uh, user load will be executed, everything will be keep on printed that one okay you not required all the data okay whenever you fail the request okay whenever you fail the request right in jmeter whenever you fail the request in jmeter that specific request only you need you can add the view results table also okay you can add the view results table uh, just a minute you can show you that one also where it's available one second no. yeah okay now you need to run yeah you can see it's a thread name right the time will be provided in thread group, thread group one and one user. Based on user load will be executed, right? One by one, one by one, one by one will be executed. Whenever you fail, right? You fail something. That one, you can go to your logs. You can easily, you can find that uh, where, which thread group, which user and which URL it's failed. You need to check and same that URL based you need to, uh, you can report it to the development team what is the error you faced okay that people remaining work will be taken okay that's all guys this video it's very simple task you can implementing okay you can learn some lim uh, little bit uh, jmeter skills right jmeter knowledge that is sufficient to be able to complete this scenario yeah that's all guys this video you like this video please subscribe my channel i will provide the more videos on same uh yeah that's all everyone i will connect to my another video soon i will connect with you thanks everyone bye